Uh, Anthony Fleetwood on Saturday. What are your thoughts going into the game? Um, yeah, it's going to be another tough game. Um, you know, um, we've obviously had a couple of tough results in past weeks, but I suppose in football you have to try and stay po as positive as you can, and you know that's what the lads are doing. And hopefully we'll have a, a reaction on Saturday and hopefully get some sort of result. The building camp seems pretty good. Is it? Is it just a case of putting last Saturday behind us now and moving forward into two pretty tough away games in a similar location? Yeah, well, I suppose in football you have to try and put, you know, put bad results behind you as fast as you can. But at the same time, I think you have to hold, you know, you have to hold that play, that that disappointment in your heart and in your head, you know, and, and make sure it doesn't happen again. I think if you just, you know, just try and say, oh, we let it go and move on, then you know, I think oh, I don't think that's the right way to do it. I think you got to just hold that disappointment sometimes, you know, inside you and, and use that to motivate you and drive you on to hopefully win the next game. And what's the message from people such as yourself this week, the more experienced players, you know, obviously as vice-captain, I'm, I'm guessing you'll be sending some clear lines up the, fir up the field. Yeah, it's just, you know, it's just um, me as an individual, I'm just going to go up now and, and, and give my all and, you know, hopefully I have no excuses at the end of the game. That's what I try and do in every game and, you know, hopefully that will rub off on the rest of the team. I know all the lads feel the same. Um, it's a collective effort, um, you know. I, I think I think everyone's got to be at their game on Saturday. We can't have any slackers. I've said it before. Um, you know, if you if you got if you have one or two off their game, then maybe you might get away with it. But when there's six, seven, or eight not performing, then you, you don't get away with it in this league. So um, hopefully the lads now will realise that you know the the, pen, the penny is, has to drop at some stage, and we have to put in um, you know some good performances. How do you think Fleet would all approach Saturday? I think they're going to be a, a, a difficult side to play against. Um, you know, similar to, to the way Joey Barton was as a player himself. Obviously, a, you know, a, a tough player to play against. I've never played against him myself. Well, he was at Rangers when I was at Aberdeen, but he left Rangers before I got the chance to play against him. But you know, from watching him throughout the years, um, you know, a, a tough physical player to play against, and I'm sure that's the way he'll have his team playing. They think they'll be fit. They'll be trying to get in our faces. So we've got to be ready for that. But. Um, so yeah, I'm looking forward to it now, looking forward to the lads there putting the performance in them. Um, as footballers, you just can't wait to get onto the pitch to put things right, uh, especially after a difficult result. So, um, so yeah, we're looking forward to it.